and welcome back. Yesterday, we reported that air pollution in China could have contributed to 1.2 million deaths in 2010. Now, the head of Beijing's Environmental Bureau says the city's pollution is getting worse. Two of the three most closely watched pollutants in Beijing have increased in the first three months since last year. Two major air pollutants in China's capital city are up 30% in the last three months, compared to this time last year. That is according to Chen Tian, the chief of Beijing's Environmental Bureau. He said on Tuesday that, from January through March, nitrogen dioxide and particulate matters of 2.5 to 10 micrometers in diameter have increased since 2012. Weather and geological factors contributed to the increase, but Chen said, quote, the emissions created by those living and producing in the city was the predominant factor. Last month, Beijing authorities vowed to decrease the city's pollution by 2% in 2013. They listed 52 measures in their Clean Operation 2013 plan. It included removing low-efficiency vehicles and planting more trees. But with the government's push to increase urbanization in China, stronger measures might be needed. During the National People's Congress last month, Chinese leaders announced a plan to shift 60 percent of China's residents into the city by 2020. The two pollutants that have increased over last year are both byproducts of coal and gas emissions that fuel both industry and domestic power. Chen said Beijing plans to become a coal-free city in the long run. However, entrenched interests have made it hard to change China's coal use in the past. China is by far the biggest user of coal in the world. It consumes almost as much as the rest of the world combined. While China is also the largest manufacturer of green technology, it has used it more as a revenue earner than a solution to its own energy problems.